Hello YouTube, it's me, Minecraft Power, and today I am bringing you another LEGO review, and today I am doing Gorzon's Gorilla Striker. And this is from the set Chima, or Legends of Chima, I should say. And the set here is ages 8 to 14, set number 70008, and it includes 500 and 505 LEGO pieces. So, in this set we get four new minifigures, we get Gorzan, Grumlo and Gorlon, along with Rizzo, which I have a quite a few of him now. So in set, as you can see, we have for Rizzo. Sorry if I'm mispronouncing any of these names. Um, as you can see, we have a little nest with a bird on, with a bird vehicle on top, along with a little coconut cannon, bomb cannon, or catapult, I should say. Then, as you can see, we have Grolon with her with the metal fist, and then we have um, Grumlo with a fist on a stick, literally. And then the main part of the set, as you can see, we have Gorzan's Gorilla Mech, and as you can see, it is it looks huge and awesome, and on top it even has a banana cannon. Banana cannon. All right. So, let's turn the box around. And, as you can see here, we have some features. First off, as you can see, the it shows that the front chest plate can fold out, and then there are some pegs on the back, and if you push them, it could fire up to six um, flick fire missiles, which is a lot. It shows that if you hit the branch on top of the nest, the vehicle part will um, fly off. It also shows that there's a handle on the back where if you twist it left and right, the fist will go up and down. And there it shows a g nice good picture of the mech with his chest plate open, or out I should say, revealing the missiles and the uh, chief. Then also it shows that the banana cannon on top is one of those high-powered Lego cannons that is painted yellow to look, look look like a banana cannon. And then also last, and then also it shows um, enter Lego Chima online, and it shows you can unlock characters. And then lastly, it shows a battle between Rizzo and Gorzan for the Chi. So this set looks awesome, um, it is probably going to be one of my favorites because I love Lego mechs, and this one looks really awesome. So now, let's get to the build.
Alright, we are back, and here is the set, and this set is awesome and huge. So first off, let's go over the mini figures. First, grab Grozon, I believe his name is, and also Rizar from their vehicles. Along with, with, um, Gorzan's hammer. So first off, let's go over the the Raven, which is um, Rizar. So here, as you can see, um, he's pretty basic. He doesn't have the new chest plate. He has the very, he has the tier one chest plate. Underneath his helmet, you can see he has one eye scratched out, and on the other side, it's basically a double headed. But that doesn't really matter when you put the head back on because the mouth expression does not change. Only the eyes. Here is his gun, pretty cool, the old fire hose slash gun mode along with a lightsaber handle and a, and a transparent red axe head, pretty neat, I like it. And then we also have the wings, the black wings, and he also has a robotic peg leg. Just take off his chest plate. And by the way, the wings are cha attached to his chest plate. These are clips. There are studs on the back of the chest plate. With, then you put clips on it. So here is the front torso. As you can see, nice detail of purple feathers. Along with the blue orb and six straps all connecting to the back part. So that is Rizar, or... Rizor, wherever his, there is his head. So, here's what I mean by like, look here's his open mouth, and then when you put the mouth, the head back on, only the eyes change, not the mouth. So that is Rizar, with his nice cannon. Pew, pew, pew. Next up, we have... We have Gorlona or Gorloon. So she has a place for Chi. She has no chest plate and she has a small leg so they do not bend. And she's obviously too small for any of the big hammers so she has a metal fist to do hit him in the balls. Um. I mean, she she looks very friendly. She has lots of plants on her. She has like a bunch of vines, plants, leaves. Pretty neat figure. Very colorful. Next up, we have. Next up, we have Grumblo. I believe his name is pronounced. So first off, here's his weapon. It is a staff and a new fist eye piece, which is pretty cool. We get two of these in the set. Also one for him, which you can take off. And then he could dual wield, but that would be pretty hard. So yeah, he could just do dual wield and beat them up. So yeah. I like these new fists on the staff, they're really neat. So now as you can see, he has a circle on his head, and he looks pretty old. He has a tier 2 chest plate, a brown one too. As you can see, he has uh, some bananas run on his belt. Here's his, one of his faces. You can just get that. In. Um, and right, there's his second, but once again, it doesn't matter because only the eye expression changes. When you take that off, as you can see, he has a chi or a placeholder, and also some white feathers, and then he has a leaf belt, along with some vines, and also a banana. Also looks like some bamboo. He has for a belt too. And also, this chest plate 
is also comes in, I believe it's, I forgot the name of it, but it's um, the Wolf's Mobile Lair. It, um, so, and um, Eris comes with the Tier 2 Chestplate 2. And lastly, for the main figures, we have Gorzan. And he is really neat. He has a nice stark black. And then, um, as you see, his mouth is obviously in combat mode. Well, combat yelling. He also has a tier 2 chest plate, same color. He has a smiley face and a roaring face, or a double headed minifigure. Then underneath, as you can see, he has a lot of body paint on him, along with some vines for a belt and also some leather. Nice detail. They have r really nice details on these leg Legends of Chima Lego sets. All right, let's put them back in their view, in the vehicles. Zan back in his mech, also, and then also Rizar back on his catapult. So first off, let's go over Rizar's Rizar's catapult, or Rizzo's, however you pronounce his name. As you can see, it is not a vehicle landing, it is actually a turret. It has 360, de 360 degree rotation. It, has, it looks like it's a um, bird that landed or is sitting down. On the side, as you can see, we have a little camp hole. And on the inside of this, we have four coconut bombs, which actually fire pretty well. So. We have four of them, which look like so. Pretty neat. Then, all you need to do is put it in there, and then launch. And it actually fires pretty far. Here, I'm going to do it at the edge of my desk. And then, fire. And it hit it, and it's still hitting um, Gorzan's mech. So, it's a pretty neat. Good little camp hole. And now, let's, go, let's do a closer look on his on his turret. As you can see, he has some lasers, laser cannons on the on the bottom, and then he also is holding a, a gun. I assume these are powerful. And then also we have some little tail feathers right there, or their wings folded up. And then also, we have this little branch right here, which, if you hit hard, on, hard enough, does this. It destroys, if you hit it hard enough, it destroys the turret. Alright. Also, we have 12 stickers in this set, and two of them are right here. So there's really, and this part is a really nice, short, fun build. Up. Oh. Looks like the can was destroyed in the process of the destruction like this. And it's pretty fun just to hit that hard enough. And um, also, the mech actually can knock that off. Alright, now let's also, by the way, this set does come with a brick separator. Alright, so now let's move on to the main part of the set. Gorzan's Gorilla Mech. This thing is huge. As you see, that's the top of my um, desk so it's pretty tall it has nice footing the fists are big and they're actually quite heavy heavier than I expected he has to lunge like this because if it's like that for me he barely falls over he's like on it yeah that's him great Pretty cool. There's some. Yep. See, sorry, sorry, fall over. So, in this set, we have two stickers right here on the feet, and we have stickers right here, and here, here, and here, and then the last two stickers are right here. Uh, your stickers, your sticker here and here, and also two right here. So, as you can see on the bottom, we have some nice legs, which nice short stubby legs. And then also, um, right here, 
as you can see, has a metal six pack. It's pretty, it's nice detail, right? Kind of funny. Then also for the arms, we have some tubes full of chi powering the arms. On the back, we, you can see the stabilizer right here. Also, if we quickly look up, we can see we have a small little clip to hold the gun, which I really like because of my pet peeve in Lego sets are when they have a vehicle and there's no place to place the weapon. Because then they get lost and all that stuff. So here we have a little lever or knob, and when we rotate it, both the arms move up and down at the same time, which is pretty neat. They can go 360 degrees, so he could break his arms like so, or you could do big smashes and then try to see if we could smash his nest. I tried it before it did work. Close, we knocked it over, but we didn't actually activate the pad smashing part. So let's see if we can get it. Come on. Come on, Gorzan. You can do it. There we are. Okay. He kind of smashed his own hand in the process, but oh well. So, another cool feature about this set is that on top we have a banana cannon, um, which does fire, like so. And I didn't, wasn't even aiming and it still hit this part. So, which means, let's say, it cannot knock it off, it's not that strong, but still, it's the heavy powered. It's a lot harder and stronger than and easier to use than for fire missiles. There we are. And I also love how they added a banana a banana cannon refill clip. That's really funny. Alright, so let's just reload that. As you can see, we have Gorzan right here. The mech is extremely detailed. It looks like a mech. This part looks like the eyes. This looks like the nose, and this looks like the mouth. And, speaking of which, if you take this part and pull it down, as you can see, we have a little inner chi core, and also six flick fire missiles, which on the back, you can see we have the butt, the um, parts right there, so now, if we wanted to, let's try to see if I can get this in a good position. Um, we can fire all six at once. Three, two, one. There we are. So that was all six quick fire missiles firing at the same time. It's kind of hard to do though without pushing his neck over. And then all I have to do to refill it is grab them and push back in. And I also love how flush this part closes up to be the mech and flush means like how it looks like it's not really there how it looks like it's just flat so and it looks really neat and then when you close it up looks like so looks like it got slanted looks like it got Damage the process. Right, there we are. So, as you can see, that's what I mean by it looks flush. And also, do not attempt to fire the missiles while it's still. But yeah, that's a really cool feature. I love the. Uh... So, yeah. And that is the mech. I. So yeah, this mech is a really cool set. Um, I I believe it retails for $39.99 to $49.99. Um, I do I give this five out. Oh well, yeah, I give this five out of five stars. 
It has great minifigures, it has great functions, it has a mech, and I personally love the Lego mechs, and this is current, so far my favorite mech. Even, in, even um, beating out the um, CL, the CLS 89, and um, Samurai Exus mechs, mech, but I still love them. I still love the mix. So yeah, this has a lot of detail in it. It has great, it has great mechanics. It has great features. It has a banana cannon, banana cannon, and um, yeah, banana cannon. So yeah, um, I recommend this set. It's really neat. You can smash people with it. You can smash things. Smashy, smashy, smashy. Smoshy, smoshy. Okay, I kind of broke it. <laughs> I even knocked him out of his cockpit. Let's see if I can try throwing. Let's see if I can throw him. I kind of threw him. But yeah, hey, this is quite destruct. This is quite devastating. Let's see if we can take out the mech, the CLS mech. Smoshy, smoshy, smoshy. I love the the mobile fists. Die. <laughs> it's so fun to play around with these fists. Die. Smash. 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 Alright, there we are. So yeah, I recommend this set. Um CLS CLS 889 is not included in the set. Obviously this is from a completely different theme. So yeah, um, if you like this video, um, please hit that like and then subscribe if you're already a subscriber and you already liked it. Thank you. I, it's extremely appreciated. And if you like this set, thumbs up. Uh, and if you like this set, thumbs up. I give it 5 out of 5 stars because it, the only downfall side is... Um, I actually can't really think of any downfall sides. So... And actually, you kind of get a good amount for your money. For I believe this is thirty nine ninety nine, and you get a giant mech, you get a turret, you get camp hole, and you get four minifigures. Three, and you even get three of the four gorilla minifigures. And I have all four because the other one comes in the um, Warris's mobile lair. So, yeah, and. So yeah, hit that like and subscribe if you already subscribed and like. Thank you very much. It's extremely appreciated and goodbye.